and welcome back to Pastor Chris Worth Reading. We're so glad to have you as we are reviewing how to pray effectively. Remember, you can call in at 1-855-378-9993. We have these books in stock and ready to ship, so you too can get your copy quickly and follow along with us. Yay! So on set, I have with me Sister Ruby and Sister Toyin. Hi. Welcome, Praise ladies. The Lord. <laughs> yeah, hallelujah and welcome. We're so glad to have you all again, of course. You know, we've been studying some really good things in these books mm. that Pastor Chris has made for us so that you too can live your best life. Absolutely. Right? And how important prayer is. Absolutely. Sure. So with that note, we're gonna get started with prayer. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for this time of prayer and study. We thank you as your divine vessels. We speak your will and your word on the earth and change things, situations and circumstances. There's nothing impossible with us. And we thank you, oh God, for the viewers that are watching, that they engage and pray effectively Amen. and receive answers Amen. as well Amen. as we study the books of our men of God in Amen. Jesus name. Amen. 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 Lord. I love that. That's right. You guys now have open hearts and are ready to receive. <laughs> to receive. That's right. That's right. Amen. You know, we've been studying the book and doing a good review so far. We are currently on chapter six and pastor tells us it's on the prayer of agreement. Mm -hmm. And you know, um, the first scripture is Matthews 18, 19, when Jesus said, if two of you shall agree on earth as touching anything that they shall ask, it shall be done for them of my Father, which is in heaven. Mm -hmm. These are words of the master himself. Yes. Yeah. You know, <laughs> this is the confidence that we have that when we can agree as touching Anything at all. Anything. Mm -hmm. Anything, Anything. Pastor C. <laughs> and it just you know? takes two people. Just one other person. That's imagine. right. That's you it. You know, it's <laughs> yourself and then just one other person. Mm -hmm. That's how easy it is. And mm -hmm. you can imagine if you're already half of that, you go to your most trusted person, you know, whether it's your parent, your brother, or sister, your best friend, uh, your pastor, a colleague, mm -hmm. someone in church, you know, and somebody that you know you're close to and depending on your prayer situation, but all it is is one other person that you just touch hands, come together in agreement to pray. Wow. Yeah, that's how this simple is it is. Authority. And how Such powerful authority. it comes. Such yeah, authority. very, very bold mm -hmm. in your prayer life, you know, when you know that that's all it takes is yeah. one other person to all come in agreement. Wow. Yeah. That's wow. all it takes. And, and you know, looking further in Matthew 16, 19, it says, I will give, I want to emphasize this to us, just like Pastor mm -hmm. made it clear to us. And I will give unto thee the keys of the kingdom of yes. heaven. Mm -hmm. And whatsoever thou shalt bind on earth, shall be bound in heaven and whatsoever thou shall lose on earth shall be loosed in heaven you know pastor said the key the word key there the keys that have been given to us in the scripture it speaks of authority yes. just like you mentioned yes. laws yes. and, and principles, principles. Mm -hmm. how amazing is that yeah, yeah and it's backed up by god yes. uh -huh. We're not yeah. just talking and the principles that are on page 87. Oh my God, amazing. Talking about the requirements for the prayer of agreement. So simple. As <laughs> simple, simple as that is. <laughs> yes. I mean, powerful. It can, it, it's very powerful. Yes. And you can get instant results. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. You know, Pastor emphasized here that, you know, there are four key principles, mm -hmm. okay, and requirements for this prayer of agreement. It says the participants must be on earth. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. So no there, praying to people who are deceased or thinking someone exactly. can agree with you Tell that's not here. Exactly. You know, just because people come from so many different cultures, we want to be yeah. clear. They they have to be alive and on yeah. earth, right? Yeah. Touch, feel. <laughs> 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 then he says, there must be at least two of them. Mm -hmm. So your not minimum participant yeah. is... <laughs> One other person. Exactly. Other than you. Yourself and just one other just person. One. Okay. It's so and simple. Then, and then they must agree. Mm -hmm. They must agree. Just like you guys just said it. Mm -hmm. That's the word. <laughs> Agreement. Like we I just like agreed that. with we, the toy. You guys just mm -hmm. agreed with me. And and the fourth is they must ask or make the definite request. Yes. Mm -hmm. How wonderful is yes. that? Yes. We talked about that the last episode. Remember, Pastor prayer mentioned that, yes, mm -hmm. in the prayer of faith. 
that we have to use specificity, that yes. we mm -hmm. must be yeah. clear and yes. definite mm -hmm. in our requests. Mm -hmm. yes. Clear yes. and decisive, mm -hmm. like there's nothing that is nothing swaying vague. your words, nothing vague, mm -hmm. very specific. Mm -hmm. And that's one of the fascinating points that Pastor even points out here, you know, that many Christians have yet to operate in the power of the four points Sister Toyin just read, because they're mostly inclined to begging God. Mm -hmm. wow. And you're not supposed to. Kings don't You don't beg. need to, exactly. <laughs> Kings, Kings don't, don't beg. beg. Exactly. <laughs> Call to be kings and priests uh, yeah, unto the most high yeah. God. Yeah. You know, so yeah. We don't beg. Mm -hmm. You got to know who you are. That's right. Exactly. You know, and the authority that God exactly. has given unto that you, authority. you are, you are yes. in his stead, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. as he is, so are we in this world, yes. you yes. know? So, you know, when we were created in his image, to act, to look, not only look like him, to function like him. Mm. And God functions in authority. Yes. Exactly. So that's why you make your demands, mm -hmm. you know, to heaven, because God is listening. That's you don't just it. tell him, oh God, please, mm -hmm. please, please. I need to get out of this situation. And then oh. that's the prayer. That's very timid. That's very, yeah. yes. you know, yes. passive. 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 Yes. Yeah. It's, no, and it's not, not very clear. Mm -hmm. No, you be direct and demanding. Mm -hmm. And pastor tells us that too, you know, as part of it, that your demands will be backed up by heaven. Yes. Mm -hmm. And God never mm -hmm. goes back on his word. When we pray in the name of Jesus, that's enough. Mm -hmm. And once two people agree, <laughs> that's right. You that's know, it, it yes. says, you know, Pastor teaches yes. us here that once two people mm -hmm. is the timing when you guys are making the request mm -hmm. that is very important. Mm -hmm. As long as both of you agree during that time, yes. it can be changed. Mm -hmm. Even right. if one person doubts. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That's right. Wow. That's it. Yes. <laughs> that's amazing, honestly. Oh, and yes. you know, the most interesting, very, very interesting story Pastor shared here, as we can see in the book of um, page 91, mm. talking about, you know, when Peter was in the prison. I, yes. mean, I, I know many of you have read that story yes. before, mm -hmm. you know, how he was locked up. And uh, right. I mean, you know how Harold and the mm -hmm. people around just thought it was okay because they had got James. It's mm -hmm. okay to capture thought, Peter, yes. mm -hmm. you know, and but while they God. had him in captivity, yeah. the church did Pray. not sleep. Right. Yes, they, they were prayed. praying in agreement. In prayer. Yes, That's right. They it was prayed. so important. Mm -hmm. And you know, and look what? at the decision or the course of change that it caused. Exactly. Yes. You know, that prayer in agreement. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, you should understand how powerful prayer is and how demanding that you can be, that it's okay to demand these things from God. Yeah. And sometimes they require a sacrifice. The church prayed, they weren't sleeping. Yeah. So it must've been time to sleep, True. right? True. So and, other and, people were sleeping. And to understand <laughs> that the church then realized that, you know what, we slacked. When they when got, got James. James, you know yes. what? We can't afford no, to slack to anymore. Peter it's go. time to wake up. Mm -hmm. Peter cannot yes. mm -hmm. be, be taken. Be taken as mm -hmm. well, you know. And then they agree. Yes, and, you know when and we come to a place a of agreement like yes. that, it's it's one of the most powerful thing Pastor mm -hmm. is trying to explain to us exactly. here. And even as a church, even as individuals, as families, you know, mm -hmm. you and your family, your children, your husband, it's important that you guys get to a place of agreement mm -hmm. on sending things and for your life, for your family, and for yeah. the church and for mm -hmm. the nations of the world as and well. And they act it because in that, in prayer, the Holy Spirit will give instructions as well. Mm -hmm. So the church acted. Mm -hmm. yes. and, and that's part of the fellowship in, you know, that you have with God, you know, that affects your prayer life as well. But don't confuse it either, you know, with thinking that you have to have the whole church, church. or, you know, mm -hmm. the whole entire family, yeah. all these people praying with you. No, two it's just more. two just people. Two you, if you mm -hmm. only have one other person, mm -hmm. that is very That's fine. Enough. It doesn't change the results or it doesn't change the degree of results that you That's receive. Right. No. Yes. That's right. No. That's absolutely just to correct. Yeah. Yes. One of the yes. things that you mentioned, Sister Toyin, earlier, but I think it's worth just spending a, a couple minutes on is that the prayer of agreement cannot be canceled simply because yes. someone doubts later. Mm -hmm. And that's mm -hmm. very important for people to know. True. Because people sometimes can think, okay, well, I prayed that and, and now I didn't see it happen yet and I'm wondering if it's going to, and then you start thinking, well, mm -hmm. oh, maybe, you know, and all that kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but so it's not true. It's not yeah. true, no, it's yeah. Not for true. example, if myself and Sister Ro Ruby decide, you know what, let's, agree concerning something. Mm -hmm. And then I leave and I'm thinking, did it really happen? <laughs> that doesn't nullify that no, answer that's right. to no. that prayer. Exactly. Because mm -hmm. at the time, 
when we both came up with whatever the issue was mm -hmm. and we decided to pray about it, it is a done deal. And yes. that's, that's how wonderful. It just also shows us how loving our Father is. Yes. Mm -hmm. Pastor yeah. says, if it took two of you to agree on that same page 93, mm -hmm. it will take both of okay. you to cancel it, <laughs> right? So one person can't cancel it. That's right. No, and when you come to me, I'm going to be like, like no, 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 I want no, it. No, we're, we're standing on it. No. Yes, you know. No cancellation. So there, and there's nothing we can't do <laughs> if we agree. Nothing. Wow. Your nothing. Power, nothing. The nothing. prayer is unlimited in your reach. You know, the sky is the limit there. Wow. So nothing wow. is it's impossible. without exception. No limits. Yeah. No limits without exception exception. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. There's nothing that we can't do when we agree. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Right. And it's Amen. simple. Mm -hmm. Very simple. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's exciting because <laughs> think of, look at the power that we have, you know, for two to pray. You can get yourself out of anything, my dear, anything, it's you know, right. and you can call for anything that you need. True. Amen. It's that's how powerful prayer yeah. is. That's why we have phone lines available mm -hmm. as well. Yes. You can call, you know, and we can agree yes. with you in prayer. Yes, that's you, true. You see what yeah. I'm saying? Sometimes we don't want to go to the person that we necessarily mm -hmm. know because mm -hmm. we don't want to say what it is. Mm -hmm. But you can call somebody that you don't know. Yeah. That's why the network is here. Yes. That's why we're so love that you brought that up. Yes. You, <laughs> and, you know, tell so. us this is what you want us to agree yes. with you on. And it's That's a done right. deal. So if there's Dad. nobody else that you have <laughs> that you even can pray in agreement with, for whatever reason or whatever situation is, call us. We will pray with you. Yeah. You can send in your prayer requests and we can call you, but give us a call because you can, we're easy to reach. 1-855-378-9993. Okay, we'll so call right. us for prayer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we'll be yes. right back. On that note, we'll take a break. <laughs> When you send your generous gift to support Love World USA, be sure to ask for your copy of Pastor Chris's classic book, How to Pray Effectively, Volume 1. The key to communion with God and access to His blessings and benefits is in an effective prayer life. And Pastor Chris will help you understand the rules of prayer and how to apply them for your desired outcome. You will gain divine insight into the prayer of faith, the prayer of agreement, praying with the Spirit, praying for material needs, prophetic prayer, and much, much more. When you give a gift of $100 or more to support Love World USA, be sure to ask for your copy of How to Pray Effectively, Volume 1. Your gift will be a significant investment in helping Love World USA reach countless souls with the gospel. And in return, your prayer life will be revolutionized as you learn and put into practice the biblical principles Pastor Chris shares along with the practical examples of what he's learned about prayer in his own life and ministry. Call 1-855-378-9993 to make your gift and request your copy. That's 1-855-378-9993. Don't delay. Call now. Welcome back. Now we're going back into chapter seven or going into chapter seven, which is the prayer of intercession. Awesome. And pastor begins by telling us that the Holy Spirit has an intercessory ministry, mm -hmm. which he carries out through believers. Yes. But there's also the intercessory ministry of the believer, mm -hmm. which is quite different. They're From not the form. same. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. Mm -hmm. The Holy the Spirit, Pastor says in here, you know how the Holy Spirit does carry out his intercessory ministry through you, through you, which is very important because, you know, when you're praying on your own or even just at any point in time when you feel like you need to pray, there's something just kind of boiling in you or nagging at you, you know? That's when you are being led by the Spirit, right? So you don't know who you can be praying for or what circumstance or what you are um, trying to change or just whatever it is, you know, but you just have to have that prayer of intercessory so that you just start praying because you don't know what you're interceding for or who you're interceding for. Yeah, and Pastor was saying here that, you know, uh, there are times that we may be just be praying about a personal issue, mm -hmm. but as you're praying on that personal issue, you know, you just, 
get that nudge, mm-hmm. that prompting like in your spirit. Just, mm-hmm. And yes. then suddenly it begins to work within you, you mm-hmm. know, prompting you to intercede for another individual. Right. And you're, you're thinking, you know, but pastor is encouraging us to do it here. Yes. However, we shouldn't just wait mm-hmm. till we have such nudgings mm-hmm. to actually intercede and mm-hmm. pray for other yes. people. Yeah. And that's what brings us saying that, you know, that, you know, the prayer of intercession is a responsibility. Yes, it's a it is. Mm-hmm. responsibility yes. of a believer. Earlier, we talked about being kings, kings and, and priests, priests having right? authority. Exactly. But, you know, so <laughs> the part of the king is the authority. Yeah. Part of the priestly yeah. is the responsibility, mm-hmm. of you prayer. know, of prayer, yes. of interceding, of talking to mm-hmm. God about people. And one of the things that I found find very remarkable here says, and it is always a blessing to function in that office. Yeah. Do you know how many people sit out there and like, oh, I want to be yeah. blessed, I want to be blessed? There's a <laughs> function for you. Yeah. There's an office for you and right I was here. Just thinking, you know, as you were even saying that, how prayer is a privilege, you True. know, because mm-hmm. it's so True. powerful and mm-hmm. the things that you can do with prayer, it's a privilege to be able to do that. That's and why you you gotta obtain that privilege. Yeah, you're right. And and it we need to see it as a privilege. So so many people see it as a burden, and it's absolutely sure. not it's a not. burden. It's, it's an opportunity for us to change the world, mm-hmm. to change circumstances, situations anywhere in the world. Hallelujah. And you know, this just kind of brings tears to my eyes sometimes when you realize that over the years or over months or days, you've been praying about a particular thing or a situation or a, a person, and then you begin to see the person change right yeah. before your very eyes. Yeah. It could be a prayer of salvation. You're mm-hmm. interceding. You know that this, you don't want them to to, to go to hell. Mm-hmm. You don't Absolutely want them to, to die abruptly. And you mm-hmm. know, you intercede so much. And then, you know, I have a personal story like that. A guy, the day I realized that he came out in front of the altar and gave his life to Christ, I, I started bawling. I was just crying. I ran to the altar. I hugged. I was yeah. like, this is re- not only rejoicing in heaven, but this is a transformation of a lifetime. Mm-hmm. Like your mm-hmm. life will mm-hmm. never yeah. remain yeah. the same. Exactly. And you're walking and upward oh, and forward yeah. just because of the intercession. Who knows? And that's a beautiful testimony. Yeah. You know, it's a testimony when you see those results, you know, that's why it's important to pray. You Mm -hmm. know, that's Mm -hmm. why it's so important to pray. Because imagine the testimonies that even come out of that and you have to testify. Mm -hmm. You know, that's another opportunity. Call us, share your testimonies because we love hearing them. The testimonies is is testifying for your prayers, you know, for the answers received, the results received. So- And many of the scriptures that we go to, they're testaments Mm -hmm. of, of, the results that were received, they were recorded. And that's why we can still make reference exactly. to the word of God even yeah. till today and oh, tomorrow, yeah. <laughs> you know. You know, on page 100, Pastor talks about the rules for intercessory prayer. Mm-hmm. Yes, and yeah, absolutely, page 102. And he says, you don't intercede for yourself. True. Mm-hmm. Right? True. True. Some people True. think, I'm going to intercede for myself. <laughs> I'm going to pray for myself. But, but you no. don't have to because it's, you pray directly for the things of yourself. It's you know. always intercessory <laughs> prayer <laughs> is always for about others. others. Yes. 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 That's why it's really interceding. About you. Yes. Yes. It's always for <laughs> about others. About others. Yes. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And you can continue in prayer wow. until you have that note of victory. That's mm-hmm. right. Until change comes. Don't let up. Don't get tired. Don't get discouraged. Continue until you see the change. And Pastor mm-hmm. is saying that, you know, to be effective mm-hmm. in the prayer of intercession, don't limit it to the prayer of petition Mm -hmm. or the prayer. You can make it a continuous thing. It's not a prayer of faith Mm -hmm. only. I mean, faith is involved in it, but the most important is that you don't give up until Mm -hmm. you see the petition that you're asking. It's like what we've talked about in the previous chapters, you know, you you take it to the courthouse, you Mm -hmm. know, you turn your closet into a war room. That's right. And you go in there and pray and pray and pray until that change happens. Don't stop And don't give up, you know, don't Mm -hmm. give up because Mm -hmm. the change will come. The change will come. You make your specific prayer Mm. and you demand it and you continue with it until you That's prevail. Yes, Pastor right. says you have an objective here, and yeah, that is right. you and I, we must prevail. Amen. You know, it's, it's so important to realize that, that you have, you're not taking a no for an answer. No, That's what that means, not. you know? No. You know? Pastor went on to talk about intercession is a divine responsibility. Mm-hmm. To know that we are here on earth 
representing God because yeah. God is divine mm -hmm. yes. and we're here on earth and he's telling us that it is a divine responsibility he's asking us to do it mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. He went on to explain to us that prayer is a privilege. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know, just like mm -hmm. Sister Ruby said earlier, don't see it as um, not a burden. A burden. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a privilege to pray mm -hmm. and especially to pray for other people, mm -hmm. you know, and then prayer is also a command. Mm -hmm. Tell me about it. <laughs> Once you're a believer, you're required to intercede yes. and pray. That's our responsibility. That's why, it's a, that's why you yes. demand because it's a command. command. <laughs> I like that. It's a divine I like responsibility. That. Yes. We have to do it. It's compulsory. <laughs> yes, yes. And the most, one of the most interesting thing about prayer that Pastor is explaining to us here is prayer is a discipline, especially yes. the intercessory prayer. Yes. It is a discipline. You have to, if you go to page 103, you can read more about that, yes. uh, telling us that, you know, we have to be disciplined in prayer. We don't just pray, especially this you prayer of intercession yeah. when we feel like. No, you know, it's not oh, about yeah, how you Yeah, because you're not serious about your results no. if that's how you take it. If exactly. If you're very like, about it, then what results are you going to expect? Your results are going to be lackadaisical as well. Yes. So yes. That's why you want to take charge and no, yeah. we don't, want don't that. let up. Yes. And we we not, we're to. not led by our feelings. We're True. led by the spirit. Exactly. Right? A responsibility means you do it whether you feel like it or you, or don't, you feel don't feel like, feel it, like it. Right? Yeah. It's your responsibility to do yeah. you do it. It's exactly. a responsibility. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. You know, many times Pastor talked, explains to us and teaches us how Many times he has even files. I, I'm sure my name is there somewhere. <laughs> you know, how he prays, mm -hmm. you know, over the people's life constantly. Laboring. You know, laboring. Yes. Even, and it's not just about unbelievers. Mm -hmm. Even laboring mm -hmm. that the will of God be formed even in the life of believers. Mm -hmm. You know, that we walk in the fullness of the perfect mm -hmm. will of God. Yes. You know, I mean, it's so important that we continue to make this intercession so we're fully in God's will, complete. Yes. You know, if you read here, it says um, Colossians 4, 12, it says that ye may stand perfect and complete in mm -hmm. all oh. of the will yes. of God. Oh, and he wow. talks about laboring in prayer on pages 104 mm -hmm. and 105 and how it not, might not be enjoyable. True. Right? Right. Not Just always like you said, you can't then. give up, you have to continue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's mm -hmm. a discipline. Mm -hmm. And and one of the things he says moving forward uh, to page 106 is not to be callous mm -hmm. in sure. your prayers. Just because your situation might be doing well, we need to always be mindful that it is our responsibility to be compassionate mm -hmm. and that Jesus is our perfect example. He was compassionate. He needs to be concerned and moved True. by the you know struggles, the sickness, the things that happen to other people. Yeah. We need to be moved to prayer. Yeah, and he says, develop the intercessor in you. So mm -hmm. each and every one of us mm -hmm. has intercession in yeah, us. Absolutely. We are intercessors. Yeah, so you can train it. yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, you train yourself through, guess what? Prayer. <laughs> <laughs> so you can train yourself to become an effective intercessor. Intercessor, sure. and that's just by continuously praying, mm -hmm. being disciplined in your prayer. Mm. Praise the Lord. Yes, yeah. he says the rule in page 111. The rule in intercession is that you are persistent mm -hmm. and continue in prayer for as long as exactly. is necessary. <laughs> There's no time limit on that. I know, as long as it until you get the results, Amen. you cannot stop. Yeah, you can't let up. Yes. I mean, we've gone through so much. Can you imagine what your prayer life is now going to be like? Mm -hmm. You are learning how to pray effectively and your life is just going to change. Right. I promise. Absolutely. It's going to change. Absolutely. Don't it's give up. It's impossible not to. When you encounter the Word of God, and the man of God explaining the word of God. He, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> See, I think it's time to pray just on that note. It's time to I'm pray. Prayer we learned about prayer of agreement mm -hmm. and also intercede, intercession. So we're going to be interceding in agreement, in agreement right now. We are. For the agreement. nations of the world, yes. for yeah. believers mm -hmm. all around the world, for unbelievers, mm -hmm. you know, that the will of God 
will be fulfilled mm -hmm. in their lives and the purpose Amen. of God will stand. Can we just hold hands yes. as we pray in tongues? Hallelujah. We also learned about praying in tongues. Let's just speak in tongues. This is the mm. power that has been given to us. Reke baba legre bose tenka rebe shende reka baba legre oshka those that are in authority mangeri bozo to they are subject to the authority in the name of Jesus maraka zataliba shantalaba reke baba lika to skeriba zataliba shata megele gele de baba zoto boshke magraba zota la baha kate tariba sete mabara ta 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 boburu bobo shende reba reke baba legre bo shanda reba reke baba Every town, every nation, every leader. Oh, hallelujah. We thank you, Lord. We give you praise. Because the nations belong to you. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to God. The nations belong to you, Lord. In the name of Jesus and your will and counsel is established in every arm of government in the name of Jesus Christ your will has been established continually we agree in the name of Jesus Christ amen amen amen, amen. oh hallelujah we hallelujah. thank you hallelujah that people in every nation hallelujah hallelujah, hallelujah. 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 they speak boldly hallelujah, hallelujah. hallelujah. in prayer and thank confession you, and intercession hallelujah. making hallelujah. Yes, Lord. dynamic Lord. changes yes. in their world hallelujah amen. 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 Oh, what a beautiful time in prayer. Wow. And using all of these tools that we have learned, you know, we hope and pray for you guys watching, you know, that you too are learning so that you can change your life. Remember, you can call us at 1-855-378-9993. We will pray with you. Very happy to pray with you. And we're looking forward to those prayer points from you as well. And if you have testimonies, ah, oh, it's my favorite part. So call us with your We're testimonies too. We're looking forward to hearing yes. them. Yes. Hallelujah. Don't forget to get your copy of the book. Mm -hmm. We will be back. We still have a Absolutely. couple of chapters to cover. Yeah. So make sure you call one 855 Three seven eight nine 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 three to get your copy today. Uh, yeah. And make sure you're practicing how to yes, pray effectively. effectively. You have to pray, yes. right? So continue in prayer, even though we're about to close for this program, you continue in prayer. prayer. Amen. <laughs> Don't stop praying. <laughs> we'll see you next time. God, God bless, bless you. you.